what is an inverted yield curve? Because I was inverted. <coughs> Normally, investors receive more interest the longer you lock up your money, right? However, from time to time, the market moves interest rates to the point they become inverted. Shorter term bonds and CDs yield more than longer term CDs and bonds. According to my economics degree, this should never happen, but it does. And when it does happen, take notice. When short term government bonds have higher yields than longer term ones, despite carrying lower risk, these yield curve inversions are often viewed by markets as a sign we're headed into a recession. This chart shows the difference between two-year and 10-year interest rates over the past 20 years. You see, it's pretty rare. It inverted for a few days during the COVID crisis, but the last time there was a sustained inversion was 2006, 2007, a full year ahead of the financial crisis. To learn more about what a recession might mean for you, check out my recent video, Five Tips for Investing During a Recession. Cheers.